thank you all very, very much. Thank you so much for the warm welcome. I'm so happy to be here and uh, with you here in Minneapolis, St. Paul for the Republican convention while we nominate Senator John McCain and Governor Sarah Palin to be our next president and vice president. I want to tell you that like all of you, uh, George and I were planning to come to enjoy this convention, to have a really good time, and uh, we would have been here tonight speaking, uh, but of course, as we all know, events on the Gulf Coast region uh, have changed the focus of our attention. And our first priority now, today, is to ensure the safety and the well-being of those living in the Gulf Coast region. and to all of those living in the Gulf Coast states and to each of you, each of the delegations from those Gulf Coast, Coast, Coast states, please know that our thoughts and our prayers are with you and your family and families and your friends who are still at home. The effect of Hurricane Gustav is just now being measured. When such events occur, we're reminded that first, we're all Americans. <laughs> and that our shared American ideals will always transcend political parties and part partisanship. We hope that the people on the Gulf Coast know that the American people are here to do what we can to assist them. <laughs> President Bush has been speaking with the officials in the region to make sure they have what they need from the federal government. And today he visit, visited the Emergency Operations Center in Austin, which is coordinating the efforts among the federal, state, and local officials. During our time in the White House, we've had the pleasure of getting to know each of the governors from those Gulf Coast states. They're all strong leaders, and they were planning to be with us today. They all also happen to be Republicans. <laughs> 